the beer is brewing and vendors are preparing for the weekend. The annual Macon Beer Fest is back for a ninth year in a row and it offers more than you think. 41 NBC's Amber Lake explains. Amber. Well, for starters, over 100 unlimited beers and wine will be available for ticket holders. And if that doesn't excite you, how about free $700 blood tests for men that check for prostate cancer? Um, they're the making beer fest. We're the making beer company, so it's kind of a great tie-in, and we're just trying to get it done together and you know make it a, a successful and large event. The Macon Beer Company has a booth at the festival every year and introduce a new beer. We don't know much about the new beer, but co-owner Yash Patel says it will be a lighter beer that ties into the River Series the Macon Beer Company has started. Have a heavy lunch and go out and drink responsibly and definitely go and check it out because you can get to see and try out a bunch of different beers for the really cheap. But the Beer Fest isn't just about the beer and wine. Oh, you've got cancer, you know, and so when you're young and you go, you don't expect that. Steve Bell is the organizer of the Macon Beer Fest and says this is the first and largest beer festival that started in Macon. The reason I started the festival was when I was 42, I was diagnosed with, diagnosed with prostate cancer. So when I started seeing that men were not educated about the disease, um, I ran across this nonprofit called Pints for Prostates, and it's about reaching men through the universal language of beer. Bell says the festival offers free blood tests for men aged 40 and above to check PSA levels, cholesterol, and a handful of other things. So what the PSA does is he gives the doctor a picture of what's going on inside the prostate gland. Then the doctor would need to make a decision if they should go on and have a biopsy. Now cancer-free, Bell strives every year to help as many men as he can. And the disease is surpassing breast cancer. And so in Georgia, we're fourth in the nation for the number of cases. Bell says $56,000 of blood tests were given away last year at the beer festival. I'm a prostate cancer survivor. I was diagnosed at the age of 47 with no family history. If I had not had the screenings, I would not have known about that. Charles Cross is the health educator at Family Health Center. Prostate cancer is the second most commonly diagnosed cancer for American men. Cross says it's never too early to get screened. And um, many times there are no signs and symptoms. Organizers say that men who are tested at the beer festival get a fast pass that lets them cut the line to get their beer and wine. The Macon Beer Fest is this Saturday on Poplar Street and it starts at 3 p.m. Thank you, Amber. Now, tickets are $35, and proceeds go to Fight Against Prostate Cancer. To purchase tickets, head to 41NBC.com for a link.